Good evening, everybody. So, have you been wondering what I've been doing? What I've been doing is raising kids and going to work and got a few updates. I, Keith said I did. Oops, sorry. Sorry for the finger there. Ah, the finger. My neighbors sold my their house right here. That's why I got them on here. So I'm going to have some new neighbors. I had some really sweet neighbors, a little Frenchman and his wife. And of course they were quiet, quieter than us, I'm sure. And we're going to have new neighbors in a day or two. So goodbye, old neighbors. I gave him that tree right there. He left his pelicans, his flamingos, everything. And he just, they're gone. He's, there's nothing in there and they're gone. Wow, that was quick. His house was just up for sale a couple days ago. He financed it himself. I haven't seen these guys in a while. These are some buddies from San Antonio. These are some real nice folks. They were here before I was. Okay, and pan to the house. I just wanted to tell you, it's hot. And things just kind of slow down when it's hot. We still need to mow the front yard. I didn't get to it. I got the backyard, but it's hot. I'll get it next week. It's not growing near as fast. I'll get it this weekend when I'm off. I'm having to just water plants to keep them alive. Oh, and another update. Kitty is no longer with us. She's buried over on the side of the house where I've been painting. I guess I could take you that way. I'm painting this old greenhouse. You can't tell how old and green the paint is until you see how new and pretty this side is. And I'm going to paint the rest this winter. See how matches shed. Woo. Oh, and there's Ruth under the house. Hi, Ruthie. You got dirt all over you. But I was going to take you and let you have a look in the shed. I did this once before and I put a video up, but I didn't leave it up. Because I had some music in it. And I didn't want to get in on anybody's copyright. So this is where I made my sister stay this weekend when she came in the shed. Aren't I nice? Okay, washer and dryer, sink. Here's your little potty. Now what we're doing is we're insulating. But well, we haven't finished yet, but we kind of wanted to get this ready because we never have any place for people to stay. See, as you can see, we've gotten the whole roof insulated because we wanted to be able to use the lofts to put everything up. And then, then I brought a futon from the house in Smithville and I still haven't cleaned up from my sister being here. So we got a bed, we got an air conditioner and we have insulated all in here and then we put her in a TV and we got an old antenna outside and you get quite a few channels. So that way, when you turn on the air conditioner and shut these curtains, which I of course made out of old king size sheets and I made some tie backs for them so you can tie them back like this and they look pretty. They look real nice. And then there you go. That's what we got so far. No shower yet. Maybe an outdoor shower behind the house after I paint is what I'm thinking. And we will continue to, don't think of parking here. We will continue to insulate as we can afford it. A couple rolls at a time probably. And finish that up. So it'll make a big difference eventually. Because man, you can feel the heat. And I was thinking that, uh, what do they call it? I watch it in all my RV videos. That silver stuff. total blank. It's an insulation foam pad. I'm going to put that in the doors, I think. It'll take us all a while. Clothes hanging up. I like to make use of the heat. I think it's crazy not to hang clothes up in Texas. Heat hates the cardboard towels. I think it makes them feel like they're sucking up the water better. <laughs> so there's my asparagus. Got some lantana growing on and I watered everything and there's Ruth again. Just wanted you to know we're alive. There's my neighbor's yard again. I'm gonna miss them. They were so peaceful. 
hope the next people are too. Here's to new neighbors. And my sister was here this weekend. We went to the beach. I'm washing out the cooler. And there we go. I think that's all I got to say. Oh, I'm fixing to go dye my hair gray and take a shower. So, y'all, stay cool and take it easy.